Hi guys and welcome to another quick video by Creation by Suying. Um, I don't mean to bombard you guys with videos like in one day and then not post anything for a couple days. It's just that since I got my craft room, well more or less my craft room, <laughs> um, my makeshift craft room put together today, I've been super duper inspired to go ahead and make a video really quickly. Uh, this is a card I already put together. I don't want to um, make all of the videos lengthy. This is for a friend of ours that just had a baby. She is actually my sister's sister-in-law. So uh, she had a baby on January 6th. Her name is Jasmine and she's just the cutest little bundle I've ever seen. I wish I had a picture that I can show you guys. But I am going to put her up on my blog. Um, my blog is Creations by Suying at blogspot.com, I think it is. Um, let me double check so I can give you guys. Let's see. Could it? Yeah. Uh, it's actually creationsbysuying.blogspot.com. So if you guys want, go ahead and visit me on there. I haven't updated anything since January 2nd since I've been running around like a chicken without a head, but I promise to update soon. So go ahead and go on there if you guys want to take a look at some stuff that I have on there. I'm a new blogger also. I started, my very first blog was December 21st. So there's not a lot on there, but please feel free to go ahead and go to my blog, creationsbysuying.blogspot.com. And this is the little card that I made for the baby, for little Miss Jasmine. That's the inside. Just says congratulations. And then the outside I stamped with baby. And I added a little bit of bling. And that's the little lamb. So let me go ahead and share with you guys how I made her. This is an A2 size card. Uh, so eight and a half paper cut in half. That gives you four and a quarter by five and a half. Sorry, I was just thinking of something. This is one of the stamps that Gloria gave me. Handmade with love. I need to get one like hers. It's so cool. Um, I actually, I absolutely love her stamps. That says, uh, it has, let me see. Give me a second. Let's see if I can get it for you guys. Because I already put her up on my board. This is the cute card that Gloria sent me with my package. And this is her stamp. Let's see if you guys can see it. Handmade by Gloria Dasher. So cute. I need to get me one of these. So let me go ahead and put this back. And there we go. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> so, to make this card, I, was, I used the Create a Critter on page 71, The Little Lamb. I love her. She's so adorable. Then I used Recollections cardstock. I had a light pink and black because if it's not anybody's, to anybody's surprise, my favorite combination of colors is pink and black. Even my Hello Kitty mouse pad is pink and black. I bought this mouse pad at Walmart, by the way. I think it was so cute. So any combination, pink and black, if you go on my blog, you're going to see everything is pink, white, and black. Um... I just love it. So basically, I cuddle bugged the back layer. Let's see if you can see how cute it is. With this folder, and of course, I didn't write down the name. I wish Provocraft would put the name of these folders on the folders itself, like next to the name. Um, but it's like polka dots, but it's like three dimensional polka dots as far as polka dots inside polka dots so I love that now for the outside sentiment I use my pink stamper uh, family and friends and I used the baby stamp and then for the inside sentiment I use my pink stamper stamps itty, uh, itty bitty licious she has the cutest names for her stamps itty bitty licious and I used congratulations I used studio G black ink and I rounded off my corners with my EK Success Corner Chomper, 
which I love it. So it was simple, it was easy, but I think it's adorable and I think Jasmine's mommy's gonna love it. So there you go guys, a quick video on a little card that I made for Jasmine. Hope you guys have a great evening. See you guys soon. Bye.